From Hollywood, time once again for Money TV. I'm Don Belarjan. Thanks for joining us. Money TV is the program all about money and what makes it happen. Well, the controversial experiment can now officially be called a failure. Not that anyone with any common sense didn't see it coming from day one. Of course, I'm talking about the Affordable Care Act, infamously known as Obamacare, the great would-be legacy of the outgoing president. Passed by a partisan Congress, most of whose members didn't bother to read it, passed without a single GOP vote in favor, passed, as Nancy Pelosi said, so we can see what's in it, signed into law as Joe Biden referred to it as a big effing deal, Obamacare has come to represent all that's wrong with government when we let them get their grubby little hands into more of our private lives. The Supreme Court let it slide. The billion-dollar website didn't work for months. People who were promised they could keep their health plans and keep their doctors soon found themselves reading policy cancellation notices and letters from doctors saying they could no longer serve their needs. For many middle-class American families, premiums doubled, coverage quality declined, and deductibles went through the roof, paying more to get less. Amidst all the bad news, state exchanges shutting down and insurance companies pulling out, the administration and the bought-and-paid-for puppet media touted the law as a success because so many more people were covered. Well, of course more people were covered. When you make it illegal not to buy it, what else do you expect? Now we find out this week that health insurance premiums are going to skyrocket once again in 2017 by an average of 25% or more. Many families are going to have to struggle to figure out where the extra money is going to come from just in time for the holidays. A family of four without subsidies could see a premium of $1,000 per month or more. $12,000 per year for inferior coverage with higher deductibles and fewer choices. In fact, many families across the country are going to discover they have but one choice. This debacle hits the middle class right in the gut. The rich can afford to pay whatever. Those on subsidies will have the increases covered by the federal government, the same federal government hurling towards a $20 trillion debt. But the middle class family who buys their own insurance, well, they get nailed again. Big government failure hurting you right in the wallet. There's your real pre-election October surprise. Now here's something that's never a surprise, our toll-free number from anywhere in the world. You're watching the program, 888-259-4449, to get free information about our featured guests. When you do call, be sure and ask to be added to the subscription list of our Money TV newsletter. That's also free. Again, toll-free from anywhere in the world, 888-259-4449. Be sure and visit us at MoneyTV.net. Please like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter.